welcome back to funny and cute caricatures my name is artist Marta Setniewski and today I will be happy to show you how I draw and color the amazing spider-man with a caricature portrait face of actor Noah Jupe let's get started I think that's how you pronounce it Jupe Jupe J-U-P-E is last name all right so first we do his cute little hair uh, we do it on this side over here Okay, so it's going to the cute cheeks over here and the other one here. Perfect, going toward the chin, rounded right here. And then moving up the face on the mouth. So cute, cool, confident smile, but he's trying to like <laughs> restrain his smile. So you see that uh, lines downward over here. Lower lip, invitation for the upper lip. Go up to the nose, you have a peak over here and then toward the nostrils and this nostril you can see it going around over here and up here and the same on this side, upper of the nose going here, the bridge and we go to the eyes. The eyes are a little bit narrow and they are not very symmetrical as you see they are like tilted this way but I will make them, let's see, make them as, as, as you you think is best. So I'll make them like a little bit more symmetrical or not. An upper eyelid. Then we do the eye inside of the eye. Iris. Beautiful. And here you can see the corner of the eye. And the bottom. Beautiful. And now we move up to the eyebrows. I will be your beautiful bushy eyebrows here. Going sideways this way and down here. And the same on the other side. Make your straight hair here, going this way and sideways. Beautiful. And let's add in the ears. There's an earring here. Alright, and beautiful curly hair. That's why I did the top of the head only with slight dots so that I know the proportions, but I don't want to cover it because it will be covered by the hair. See, and that looks a lot better when you finish it with the hair. Alright, perfect, beautiful. Now let's proceed to do the Spider Man body. So we see the arms going like in a line over here this way and here toward the arm I need uh, the neck neck going this way and here toward the here and here perfect and then we have the, the chest going here to the shoulder this way we have a little muscle here and the arm going that way toward the glove. The glove going here. The fist, like kind of square shape, going toward the thumb, like this. And the other side. And then we need the um, fingers to be in a fist shape. Over here, holding on to the spider web. All right. Has the spider the way. Okay, and the other arm going this way. We have a shoulder like this one, a lot bigger on this side. Toward the muscle right here. And the glove over here. The glove is hidden by the arm. Here we have the hand. Let's see that distance. And that distance is fairly the same. And here we get the finger. One finger here. Then we have this one. Bent over here, another one. Also bent, and the other one up here. Going this way. Beautiful. And then we have the thumb on this side. Perfect. And then the spider web will be coming out from here. <laughs> and yeah, let's do the body, the torso. 
Going this way under the armpit, you can feel muscle like this. And towards the waistline, so you have your chest, rib cage, six pack. Is that too skinny? Maybe. Okay, here would be the uh, belt, like that, and here. Going on the chest like this. And that's the part that will be red in our drawing. You will have a little spidey. You do like L shapes for the legs. Alright. And then going toward the belly, and this will be the the leg going here. And over here, like this. I'm gonna make the leg a little bit maybe muscular as well. Here is the knee, and here is the other part going this way to the foot. Toes, sole of the shoe, and the heel. Like this, perfect. And then the sock would end over here, and the other leg would go like over here. This way and this way. Going here and go straight toward the foot. The heel being here. Like this, like this, and going here. It's smaller because it's more in the back. There you go. And then we can draw the sock over here. The belt, finish the belt. Mm, aha, I see. This goes here. There should be a little spot here for the six pack and the belt going here and here back here and that's it all right we can draw some lines for the spider webs or it should be right here here will reinforce the six pack here will be the spider like this spider web later we will, uh, we will color it so it will not be that visible anyway so don't don't worry about it being perfect yet here on the fingers a little bit just like you see here and perfect let's go in with color i want more hair a little more hair for a bit of body. okay we need color let's do flesh time mm. oh yeah this one's perfect we do flesh tone just laying the the base mid tone there you go under the eyes here top of the lips here around the cheeks i want to leave some white on the cheeks and on the top of the nose and also on the top of the chin here perfect and blend it look how beautifully it blends beautifully that's why i love soft pastels they blend so wonderfully just like oil paints but without the toxicity or drying time and you can do it while you're still breastfeeding you can paint with pastels but you cannot do that with oils that would be toxic for the little baby. All right, and I'm still feeding my baby Lily. Okay, and let's do red for the lips. Red for the lips and for the upper lip as well. Oh, see, it's not a sharp point. Here. Upper lip as well. Blend it away so it's not as strong. So here's a boy. Don't want as strong. And his cute little cheeks. Her cute cheeks and on top of the nose and down the cheek on this side and he looks adorable <laughs> like a little baby we can add some red here and here for balance we can add the red whatever on the clothes it needs to be red oh, oh yeah no no actually this shoulder is red and this one is blue so yeah i think okay belt six pack over here this glove this hand Socks. Beautiful. We can plant it. Here we are. And let's plant it gently on the face. Okay, this looks so cute. The same here, round the mouth, following the the shapes of the face. We can add some here. So cute. Okay, and we need, let's do shadow on the eyes, on the uh, shadow from the upper eyelid, cast onto the eyeball. 
from the making gray we don't need gray anywhere else um let's do the eyes hmm, i want um uh, about this one yes dark brown for the eyes and i can use the same for the hair and we can use the same dark brown to maybe let's see blend it oh, too light it's too light no i want darker i'm gonna have to make it darker um the hair this one hmm. it's there but it's yellow brown and i want warm brown red brown We have to settle for what we have. Okay, let's do this one, and then maybe we will add a, a black outline anyway, so doesn't matter. We can use the same um, color to make shadows on the on the red of the of the uh, superhero outfit. What is it called? Power suit? Suit? <laughs> All right. See how beautiful it is. Wonderful. All right. Pianki. Uh, sorry, it said beautiful and polished. Pianki. Now, let's uh, finish the eyes. I want to get some depth in it by adding orange. Like this. All right. I want this one even darker. I'm going to add some burgundy. Although this, this check isn't really... I don't know. It doesn't it give doesn't give up um doesn't uh, lay the color very very well. I must have spilled something on it. Okay, here we go. Perfect. Let's do blue for the uh, for the uh, spidey suit. Over here for the legs and for the other leg. Maybe here will be darker because it's in the shadow. Here we can already. Layer on darker here the muscles go this way this is the oh, and here think about where the shadows go and just blend into the light like this perfect and the other side oh and here is a little bit of a bluish spot as well i'm taking off from this finger and putting it here without using the actual pastel you can just transfer by using your applicators <laughs> and Let's um, add, so we have lights, we can do some lights, how about lights? Let's do the light here, light blue here for shadows, for the um, lighter parts. Goes here, reinforcing the muscles. Oh, 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 be so strong. Beautiful, blended. And uh, let's use the same, maybe a lighter red. On the on the suit as well, where it needs to. Well, now this is so rich, maybe too rich for a caricature. <laughs> Let's see. <yeah. laughs> Let's not get carried away. It's easy to get carried away into more details than is absolutely necessary. So uh, for now, I'm gonna go with the light to some highlights on the curls, on this way and this way. And I'm gonna do some on the forehead here. See here the line on the nose, the little bow on the top of the nose. Here's little cheeks. Okay, the chin. Here, indentation on the lips. I will use a um, red pencil or brown pencil to do the maybe a little bit shadow on the lips. See, so it's more realistic. And we can use the same pencil to reinforce the eyes. It's brown eyes and make like little lines inside and around. Maybe on her lower lower eyelid here. Perfect. And then um, lights on the fingers. You know what? Instead of that, because we do have this on the muscles, on the blue. Here we could, but I want to use actually um, this one too. Excuse me, uh, to do the um, spider web, reinforce the spider web over here. That would be a lot cooler because it's bigger contrast, so it's gonna be more visible. The six pack on the belt, 
on the legs here and here and here and a few lines over here and over here and this is a spider spider web um, size and now let's uh, re uh, rest to the darker outline hair try the curls it's so cute all right so you want some of the light to shine through but to have a darker outline because his hair is very very dark well not that very dark but it is darker okay there you go you can blend get darker here and there beautiful and then we do the eyebrows i will oh i didn't blend the whites blend the white gently make it as cute as you can there you go and over here and over here beautiful a cute little boy and i want to use uh maybe this one small sharp to make the little lines and over here the eyebrow going this way this eyebrow similar contour the eyes like this and then the inside the eyes and a little shadow from the top lip maybe lines make it more realistic and the same this eye contour the eye and here And the iris and little lines barely visible but when you look closely it will be more notable and your clients will appreciate the, de the details and then corners of the mouth reinforce the middle of the mouth with the peak here and the other side under the lip oh is there a black spot over here oh if you get a um if you get a spot that you want to erase, um, just use the flesh color and go over it. Like here I have a little black. It will be for my dirty finger. Um, use the flesh color and go over it. Okay, and then shadow under the under the cute little chin. Beautiful. And then we reinforce the suit. Here's the spidey, sharp legs. Make this like a sharp seam. Going down here. Beautiful, we can reinforce with the leather, it goes this way, this way, the belt this way. Beautiful, the arms here, here. So we're just outlining. Beautiful. This one is up here. Here we come. We can do the cheeks on this elbow. I'm gonna. Uh, later erase the, the uh, background so it will be nice and sharp then over here we got the body going this way let's this way toward the foot round and round going up here toward the sides the other leg yep, and there we go and yeah let's add some lights in the eyes And all you have to do now is erase the fingerprints where, where you went over. And so for that, we don't need to record it. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate your support. Please like, share and subscribe. And yeah, I see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye.